The hybrid energy center will benefit Southwest Virginia by bringing jobs to this area, much needed jobs. It will be an economic boom for Southwest Virginia. It will create not only jobs for the construction of, of the center, but it will also create permanent jobs at the center as well as creating additional coal mining jobs. It should uh, estimate it to produce 300 to 350 coal mining jobs, which are very beneficial since uh, coal is the mainstay of the economy of Southwest Virginia. The plant's ability to burn gob piles and biomass will help us clean up a lot of past mining practices that were before reclamation was required. A lot of these gob piles were just uh, around near facilities where the coal was cleaned. A lot of fine coal went into these piles. It's leaching into the waterways into the, and filling up the streams and, and creating real problems, pollution problems in southwest Virginia. And this will help us get rid of that problem and, and uh, really improve the water quality greatly in southwest Virginia. Carbon capture is uh, certainly a technology that's being developed today and it does work. Uh, we're trying to prove uh, not only in Virginia but throughout the southeast. Uh, Virginia Tech has taken the lead on, on capturing carbon dioxide uh, from various sources, certainly power plants, and injecting the carbon dioxide deep in abandoned uh, coal mines and in other uh, mineable structures. I believe the, uh, uh, the Hybrid Center Energy Center is going to be an incubator for new technologies uh, throughout Southwest Virginia. Uh, certainly carbon capture will be available. This site, uh, Virginia City, uh, is certainly going to be one of the best sites uh, possible to allow for uh, uh, carbon injection in, in abandoned coal mines. Uh, I think this center for uh, uh, Energy Center will also uh, develop new technologies and be an incubator for those new technologies such as coal conversion uh, uh, through uh, biotechnology and even coal to liquids.